With a rise in fentanyl abuse, addiction, and overdoses, the Santa Cruz Surgery Center is taking action to help prevent deaths from these addicting drugs, a battle that is deeply personal for the center CEO, Lisa Cooper. Um, in April 2020, we found out that our then 20-year-old uh, sophomore college student had a drug addiction. The surgery center is providing its physicians with Narcan, a drug that helps reverse the effects of an opioid yeah. overdose, something Cooper says saved her son's life. He ended up doing the fentanyl, and he ended up having three overdoses. And all three of those overdoses, it was Narcan that was able to save his life. So far, the center has distributed 66 doses of the life-saving drug. We're going to be getting these out to our physicians here on staff and hopefully get some more that we can continue to give it to the rest of the physicians here in the county. In 2021, the California Department of Public Health reported over 21,000 emergency visits for opioid overdoses. Doctors say small amounts of opioids can cause breathing problems with potentially deadly consequences. With fentanyl, it's a microgram. So you can get enough that sits, you know, on the, the head of a pin that is going to have a systemic effect on a patient. What we're delivering to our providers now is a nasal spray. And so these, they can be administered that quickly. And so as uh, Dr. Otto was explaining to us about the nasal spray, he's going to uh, demonstrate uh, what it's supposed to look like. So what's important to understand is that the uh, Narcan in somebody who has not taken opiates does not have any effects necessarily and it's um, otherwise considered relatively benign. These actuated um, uh, single dose sprays are simply applied to the nares and uh, one shot and that's it. And you just received a dose of Narcan um, and that'll save a life. Right now, you know, my son, maybe he can't be helped. But right now, one of these physicians might be able to help somebody else's son. And so that's what's really, it's helping me sleep at night. In Santa Cruz, Jake Flores, KSBW Action News 8.